Welcome to MVP Cast. Today we're going to be going over some tutorial videos. In today's video we're going to be going over the live stream option using the mobile application. So we're going to go click on this event that we've created. Let's click on camera and we're going to select this left option called the live stream. So this will live stream the entire event to all your followers, people watching and tuning in. When you click play, over here on the right, it's going to start live streaming. You can see this green dot, yellow dot right here, that displays the connection status. Over here on the left, you can actually see the connection in megabytes per second. Your battery, your resolution. Again, clicking on this score will increase it. Clicking on that will increase it. You can also click the minus signs to the left and the right of each score to subtract. You can click play or pause. And clicking the square dot that was previously up here will actually stop the broadcast fully. Um, also, if you want to indicate that a set has finished, you can click the set button over here. Or if the match has finished, you can click match end right here. Note that clicking match end will not actually finish the live stream. The way you finish the live stream is by clicking this pause, um, sorry, not pause, but square button over here on the top right. Also, we do recommend when you do not want to be filming to click the pause button to save memory and space in your live stream event. Over here in the top two buttons, you can actually use the zoom, control how far zoomed in you want to be. We're going to click end match, and the match has finished. Click the red button to finish the broadcast, and the broadcast has now finished. We can return, and we can see that in our events, that event has now just finished. Thank you for tuning in today. This was MVP Cast tutorial videos. Hope you enjoy.